What's up? This is Rick. Gonna do a little shave video. Why not? And a hair grease show. I guess Anderson's doing a hair grease show. I'm using a theta, what I do, I just run it under some water, do a little shake or two. Actually, put back under the water. Because I haven't showered, so I'm actually going to just use the water from the brush to wet my face. Just start wetting everything up. I put some water on the top. This is one of Tim's soaps. <clears throat> Smells great. It's a tobacco scent that he was trying out. Um, got two thumbs up for me. It, it's absolutely, honestly, I don't call it a tobacco scent. It's kind of more of a spicy, uh, woodsy type scent. Um, <clears throat> phenomenal scent, however. Now, I, I've read some stuff people have trouble lathering his soap. I, I don't get why or how. I mean, the stuff just lathers flawlessly to me. Um, and I'm just going straight from the pup to the face. If I went to a bowl, I could probably produce you know, copious amounts of, you know, lather if I wanted to. Um, I don't really want to, so I'm not doing that. <clears throat> but, uh, you know, I, if his does lack in any way, shape, or form from anybody else, I'd say it definitely makes up for anything it lacks in slickness. I mean, it is just a really slick soap. Um... And I, I love it. I mean, it's, you know, I'm having a lot of fun with it and stuff. So, you know, a little quick lather up here. Make sure some of your hair greases. What are you doing up there? Oh, Landon, you're okay. Oh, Landon's doing his hair. Okay. We'll let Landon do his. All right. Now, I just honed up a razor, so this is going to be kind of interesting because I'm doing a video of a razor, I have no idea how it's going to shape. I'm going back to the puck for a little bit. Because I can. Let's get a little bit more in there. I'll get a little bit more in there. That's my fault. Oh gosh, making a mess. <laughs> that feels pretty good. I'm going more by feel of how it feels on my face than anything else of how it looks. My word. Um and right now it feels nice and slick and wet, and that's what I want. You know, it's it's not dissipating off the face; it's staying where I put it. Um, I'm pretty happy about that, so no problems at all. I've actually already stropped the razor. Just put this stuff Scoot in the over a little bit. Just put this stuff in the that, that's fine. What is it? It's a uh, aftershave balm or actually aftershave wax. This is a Mizzou. Not be confused with Missouri. Part of the SEC, you would understand that. Let's see. Huh. Daddy, what is this? I don't know how I like that one or not. It, it's got kind of a wedgy feel to it, and it did whenever I was testing it as well. So I'm not real surprised. But I mean, it's shaving pretty well. Um, Could it shave better? I don't know. I might take it back across the stones just to see. But, you know, we're getting all the hair for sure. It just has that, I mean, does that look wedgy at all? Should it feel that way? It feels pretty good. You don't need it. If it's wedgy, I mean, there's just a different technique that I'll use to kind of enhance the edge a little bit. So, um... I actually took this out to equivalent of about a hundred thousand grit. Um, kind of interesting. <clears throat> Whose video is that, Daddy? Mm, it's everybody's, son. Or anybody's, nobody's, whatever. Daddy, just want to make for poops and grins, buddy. Um, what's this one smell like? Oh, we're not going to smell it. A little tug there. That could be, you know, a weak beard and a weak old beard, I should say, and lack of prep. You know, what you saw me do is the only prep I did, so. And it is very, very slight. I can't push this down. It's all right. It don't go down all the way. See that loop it has on it? Mm -hmm. That prevents it from going down all the way. I'm going to put a little bit more right there. You can never have too much lubrication on your chin. My pen, yun. Hmm. Uh, 
I just don't know if redoing this is going to change it much or if that's just the way it's going to feel. It's really, it's not bad. Just different. Daddy. Ah. Daddy. You know, there's only one way to find this thing out is just to run it back across the stones, rehone it, and shave again. It's either going to improve or not. And a lot of times, I mean, you can't hurt it. You know, it's kind of like putting a second coat of paint on. I mean, you know, you really can't hurt it if you do it right. You know what I mean? Of course, there's, you know, exceptions to every rule and always a variable and blah, blah, blah. So. Nothing is fact, I guess. Landon, found a, Landon made him a razor, huh? Yeah. Four hair greases to share, and two that are mine, two that are daddy's. Happy signing day, everybody. If you're an Alabama fan, I guess you're probably celebrating. Um, being a South Carolina fan, I mean, we've got nothing really hoop and holler about. Yeah, it was nice to see one, we have one local commitment come in. That was nice. Um, yeah, we, we do college ball around here, guys. You know, the NFL junk, really. Yeah, we watch it, sure, but it's... That's not where it's at. You know what I'm saying? Yes, yeah, sir! Alright. So I'm actually going to do a quick little relather. And I'm going to rinse out the brush just a little bit, shake it out. You should have let me do it now. What do you want to do? Share your hair grease. Alright, well, hold on. I can't get you up here. And yours. Well, neither one of us even are wearing any hair grease. How are you going to tell people about hair grease? What? How are you going to tell somebody about hair grease? You ain't wearing it. Uh, I don't now you do this. You done this, this day you definitely want to use a good smelling shaving cream. What, what's it smell like? Like a petunia. Like a petunia. <sighs> Not sure. I don't want to smell that. Daddy, they don't see you. See? Oh, yeah. Well, that's just a... Your battery's dying. Oh, excuse me there, lady. What? Over there. Right, uh, tat tat. Alright. So, that was a test shave after a honing. Um, honestly, I'm not going to pass it. Uh, those of you that have ever gotten a blade from me know I'm extremely picky. I know you guys get annoyed with me because you want your razors back fast. Um, but if it's not, if I'm not in love with it or if I don't feel like I've done everything I can, I don't like to send it out. Yeah, I could send this out. I could call it shave ready. You very well see. But, like I said, I don't know if I can get it better. But I'm not going to be happy until I've tried. Um, <clears throat> Look what he's doing. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to try it. Try to get a little bit better. And uh, see what happens. Try it again. I'll try it in a couple more days. And, uh, gosh, if I remember, I might even post a video. Of course, the chance of that happening and me remembering something are probably my memory's about as long as my razor. What did you think I was going? I got kids in here. Huh? What's the matter with you? All right, we don't need all this. All right, um. My turn. I didn't really explain anything I was doing. So, maybe you're following along. You may have learned something. You may have got confused. If you got questions as to why, how, or something, you know, that, I've, that you've seen me do, please ask. Um, my turn. Yeah, it's, it's your turn for sure. I do what I know that works for me. You know, sometimes it's fun to hear things from other people. But, mm -hmm. you know, you pick up new ideas, learn new techniques, what have you. So, let me go with here. Here, you're there. Hey, Grace. <laughs> All right. Landon, 